Joni with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 future cast. From temperatures in the 30s this morning to temperatures in the 70s as we go into next week. Temperatures all over the place in that seven-day future cast. We'll get to that in just a few minutes. First things first, though. This is a look at live Pinpoint Doppler 12. No raindrops showing up locally. I want to take you in a little bit closer to Roger Williams Park. You can see we can zoom in very tightly here with live Pinpoint Doppler 12. And here's a look at your forecast for Roger Williams Park during the morning hours of tomorrow. In fact, we have the Making Strides Against Breast Cancer event going on here. 44 degrees at 8 o'clock in the morning. By 10 o'clock, we're at 50. And 55 by noontime. So get out here and uh, help out with a good cause. We may get a little bit of sunshine, but I think more clouds and sun and definitely bring along the jacket to start things out. All right, here's a look at this afternoon. Earlier, you could see the clouds streaking by. All in all, a pretty nice fall Saturday here in southern New England. You can see the Providence River right here in Narragansett Bay in the background. Here's a current picture, obviously much darker because it's, well, 11:15 at night. Temperature 46 degrees, winds out of the west at 3 miles an hour. Other temperatures in the low 40s, 41 in Taunton, Smithfield 41 degrees, Westerly 43 in Newport at 42. Because of the increase in cloud cover, temperatures right around the 40 degree mark in Providence, so not quite as cold as last night, but obviously our suburbs will get a little bit cooler than that. Here is some precipitation sliding across upstate New York. A few of these showers may make it through into southern New England, but that will be the exception rather than the rule. Overnight tonight, mostly cloudy, 44 degrees around midnight, 42 around 3 o'clock in the morning, down to 41 during the pre-dawn hours. Tomorrow afternoon, into the 50s we go. It will be calmer with the winds, however, not as much sunshine as we got yesterday, so kind of a trade-off for Sunday afternoon. 59 by 3 o'clock by 5, we're down to 57 degrees. 59, you're high in Newport for Sunday, 60 in Westerly, Coventry at 59 degrees. Northern Rhode Island temperatures in the upper 50s with 57 in Burville, 58 Foster, 59 in Situate. Today we had some wind gusts close to 30 miles an hour. Tomorrow much calmer winds generally between about 5 and 10 miles an hour out of the south. 59 in Westport tomorrow, New Bedford at 60, Middletown 59 in Seekonk 60 with mostly cloudy skies. Again, a little bit of sunshine here and there as possible. And out on the water, winds out of the southeast at 5 knots. Visibility pretty good for most of the day. Waves one foot or less. High tide, 8.56 in the morning. Low tide, 2.59 in the afternoon. So that seven-day futurecast breaks down like this. Look at Monday, 69 degrees. Most of Monday is dry. A chance of showers and thunderstorms Monday night to Tuesday. Tuesday, we'll see the chance of some showers and storms with a high of 70. Wednesday, some hit or miss showers possible. 72 is your high. The humidity will also be increasing at this point. Thursday, 69 with a chance of showers. And then Friday and Saturday, finally back to reality with those temperatures. But temperatures way above normal as we go into the first part of next week. So, you know, we've been getting used to these very very chilly nights where you have to kind of bundle up. Not really the case for some of the work week. If you want more updates on this very exciting weather forecast I just presented, you can always uh, go to our iPhone application. You can download that from iTunes. All right. Thanks so much, yep. Pete. Coming up on iWin.